Hello guys, I'm, my name is Kerim, I'm from Turkey and I'm a student of University of Tartu in Innovation and Technology Management and I will try to explain my department and how life is in Tartu in general and the building behind me is at my faculty. So let's go inside and see what's going on in the faculty. So yes, now we're inside. So this is the uh, entrance, if you can see. And this is the corridors in the faculty. So I will try to talk about Tartu mostly. I came Tartu next last year. And now I'm a second year master student. This is my final year, final semester. And I will start writing my thesis. So uh, you can... Tartu is quite good. You can find most of the things that you would like to do here, like cinema, theater, going to restaurants, nightlife. And it's, it's cheap at the same time. You can, uh, you can live for 400 euros per month if you cook or if you make some... Uh, if you go out to eat, if you cook your own food, you can spend around 400 or 300 euros per month. And uh, you can see the corridor here. And, and, and then. Sorry, yes. And uh, there are some supermarkets. And I'm living in dorm. So we have two supermarkets near the dorm. Which you can buy your food. Anything you want. And dorm is a bit also cheap. If you share a room with someone else, you pay around 100 or 120 euros per month. And you will have everything. You will have internet, you will have heating, you will have a bed. You have pretty much everything. And dorm is quite good in a flat because you'll meet some new people. And, uh, and yeah, there was something going on and a bit too much noise. So yeah, dorm is quite good. In that sense, of course, you can rent a flat if you want, and yeah, that's pretty much it. You can you can spend less money and get a good education here. And the weather is, of course, cold. It's snowing outside, and it's around minus 15 degrees. But it's quite good. <laughs> I like the cold. So now I will I will talk about my apartment in one of the classrooms. So hello again, uh, we're in the faculty and I will show you the classroom, like one of the classrooms in the faculty, in the department. So let's go. So uh, this is the, uh, this is one of the classrooms. Like you can see it like this, sorry. This is one of the classrooms. So uh, now I will talk about the department in general, like which courses that I've taken, uh, what are the job opportunities after graduation, what can you do after graduation, and what are the deadlines, what is the tuition waiver, and do we, does the department have some scholarship opportunities and so on? Yeah, I wrote, I wrote them down, so I will just check and tell you guys. Tell you people, sorry. <laughs> so uh, the department is a bit uh, hybrid. We have courses from computer science, we have courses from economics, and if you cho choose some language courses, you will have some courses from language faculty. I chose Estonian. I know a bit Estonian. So uh, first, the uh, first semester will be intense because it's you will start and the courses will be a bit too much. The workload will be too much, and uh, it it goes down. The workload goes down. Passing when you pass the semester, it will be a bit easier than the last one. So, and this is my innovation and technology department, or University of Tartu has this program. When you, when you take the specified courses, you will have a chance to get business analysis diploma. 
or business analysis, business analyst certificate. If you, you will, you can check this information online. It's a good opportunity, but of course you'll have to pay. And uh, the uh, so we what what we are doing in this, this department, we are basically the becoming the managers in software related products, software related companies. You can be after graduation, you can be a business analyst. You can work in marketing department. You can do some data analysis because we have some courses related with data science also. You learned how to use R, how to uh, interpret the data, how to analyze the data, and how to create like, valuable knowledge after the data process. Like, basically, pretty much you can do whatever you like after graduation as a manager. And uh, so during the during the courses, the the the, the worst thing is not the worst, but it's a bad thing. The course structure is very rigid. It lacks versatility. You don't have a chance to choose which course do you want to take. Because if you have five or six mandatory courses, you'll have to take them. And you don't, you don't have a chance to take any additional courses, any additional courses. It's a bit rigid in that sense. And the Estonia is a bit, how to say it, inter, entrepreneur company. You can you can create your own company. They support you a lot if you have a good idea. They support you in every way they can, both in financial mentoring, whatever you, you want to name it. They support you a lot. You can even create your own company here because they have good opportunities and good advice they'll support you and yeah I will sit and uh, so how will be the application let's talk about the application so the applications are open now you can apply and the deadline is 15th March final assessment will be on 15th of May and the academic year will start on 2nd September and 25 students will get accepted, 18 of them will get a scholarship, like tuition waiver scholarship. The rest of them will have to pay 3,400 euros per year. And uh, you, need, you need to apply through Dream Apply. It's an online application. You apply first, you put your results there which are the, your bachelor's diploma, your essay, you need to write motivational letter in your English language trans, trans proficiency test result you need to put. And uh, they will assess you, like 60% of your motivational letter and 40% of the uh, last, the, uh, your bachelor's degree. So the assessment will be 60% of your motivational letter score and 40% of the average grade of the previous study level. They will assess according to it and you need to get at least 66 to get an assessment or they will disqualify you. And uh, as I said, you will, you will do your application through Dream Apply. You need to submit your essay and your official copy of your bachelor's diploma, your transcript or diploma supplement, and you need to trans translate your bachelor's diploma and supplement into English if it's not in English, and you need to certify it and not not notarized it, and you need to put your copy of the passport page that states your personal information and you need to pay a fee before applying, it's 50 euros. You need to pay 50 euros to apply, University of Tartu. And this wasn't in the requirements last year, but they put it now. And the uh, tuition wave is also increased 
last year it was a bit cheap than this but yeah anyways that's that's pretty much it that I can say and I hope to see you in Tartu I hope we will see each other here so goodbye